if the idea of retiring in your early 50s, 40s, 30s, or even late 20s appeals to you, you may be interested in joining the FIRE retirement movement. Designed for those who have both the discipline and cash flow to save diligently, FIRE can be an effective path towards living a work-optional lifestyle. Today, I'm going to discuss what FIRE is and whether or not it may be right for you. So first, what is FIRE? FIRE stands for Financial Independence Retire Early. This program, inspired by Vicki Robbins' book, Your Money or Your Life, is built on the premise of saving more money month to month than traditional retirement planning and utilizing low fee investment options to be able to afford retirement earlier rather than the traditional age. The financial independence portion of FIRE is considered to be about 25 times your yearly expenses. For example, if you decided you needed 50,000 a year to live off in retirement, you would need to save 50,000 times 25 or 1.25 million to be considered financially independent. Once that number has been met, you'd be able to retire and enjoy a life of financial freedom, withdrawing about three or 4% from your nest egg each year. Next, let's look at the top considerations before joining the FIRE movement. Retiring in your 30s may sound too good to be true. In fact, the whole FIRE movement and premise of retiring early can sound like more of a daydream than reality. And for some, it may be just that. But for others who are able to or willing to embrace the lifestyle, financial independence early in life can be possible. Here are a few important considerations to make before deciding if the FIRE program may be right for Consideration you. Consideration number one, you'll need to spend wisely. The big factors of the FIRE program are income, expenses, and time. The idea being the bigger the gap between income and expenses, the less time it will take you to reach financial independence. And while it may sound extreme, depending on your timeline and desired income level in retirement, you could be looking to save more than half of your income to put towards an early retirement. This is something that would need to be calculated individually as it's based on your income level and your current expenses. However, living a frugal lifestyle now is almost always a universal requirement of the FIRE program and other early retirement seekers. Consideration number two, FIRE followers don't embrace traditional retirement. For those looking to retire early using the FIRE method, retirement doesn't mean sitting around and doing nothing. FIRE followers are typically more focused on the first part of the acronym, financial independence, than they are on retiring early. That means that they're likely to still work in retirement or pursue a passion project that they were previously unable to do due to the confinements of a full-time job. Consideration number three, you'll want a why. And this is important in so many different aspects. Like other financial goals, it can be hard to find the motivation to skip dinners or to cut out splurging on a new outfit. When you have a nondescript idea of retiring early, there's little motivation to skip out on some enjoyment today for the possibility of an early retirement a decade down the line. Instead, those who have embraced the FIRE method often put a why to their savings program and it's important to get as specific as possible. Simply wanting to quit a job you hate doesn't bring much motivation or a promise for future fulfillment. If that's the case, you may be better off exploring a new career path. Instead, you may want to find financial independence in order to achieve your travel bucket list, or you may want to pursue music or art full time, or perhaps you've always wanted to have your own business, Whatever it is, you want to define your why and let that guide you in making positive progress towards your financial independence. The FIRE program is an appealing method of reaching retirement early on in life, and it allows for followers to find the flexibility in doing what they love. It does, however, take self-discipline and the ability to spend less today in order to save for tomorrow. If you're considering the FIRE method, it may be wise to work with a financial professional who can help you understand your current spending habits 
and what you'll need in order to find that financial independence for an early retirement. For more financial tips and strategies, be sure to follow me on Instagram where you can download my free financially fit 12 month planner. Let's make this the year you become financially fit.